Responsible. I am responsible for my own success. For my own success. I will achieve. I will achieve all my goals. All my goals through hard work. Through hard work and determination. And determination. Today, today, I will make the choice. I will make the choice to be a positive influence. To be a positive influence for my peers, for my, peers my, school, my school, my family, my family and my community. I will put a hundred percent into everything I do and I will take my education to be prepared to go to What's something you're thankful for? I am thankful for my family. I am thankful for my newborn nephew. He turns four months in two days. My family and friends. I'm thankful for my friends. Hey, Nelson here. Wear some super yeah. strong, flexible tape that can fix any leak. Watch. It works. Oh no, my pencil. Strong tape is so strong it can prevent intruders from breaking it. Super tape, it can help you fix any problem you might have starting at $3.99. Hello, and today we're going to be talking about the PPIS. Today's topic is the stairs. In the stairs, you either walk up or down like this. Remember to use a rail if needed. And please never do this. It's just not safe. Hello, and welcome back to PBIS. Today's topic is the bathroom. In the bathroom, you want to use everything appropriately, like the sinks. Make sure you use your appropriate soap and water. And please, wash your hands. In the bathroom, you want to make sure you use it properly too. You know, pick up after yourself. And also, please, keep in your own stall. Don't look at anyone else. What's new in the Dream Lab at HGA? Sphero Indie is a great way to introduce kids to coding. The yellow makes it continue, and the green makes it go a bit faster, and then it's going to end it with purple for a surprise. Okay. <laughs> Yeah. It introduces students to the logic of coding without having to learn the actual writing of code yet. Yeah. After an hour or so, students will be ready to move on to the Sphero Bolt and turn-based coding and block-based coding like Scratch. So come explore an intro to coding with Sphero's Indie in the Dream Lab at HGA. Hello, today we're going to be making a paper airplane. First, you're going to have to fold the paper in half. Then you're going to have to fold the right corner or the left corner into the middle. Do the same thing for the other side. And then you're going to fold 
the right corner or the left corner to the middle and you do the same thing to the other side and then it should look like this And then you fold that piece that you just folded down, you fold it to, towards you, and then you fold the other side towards you again. Throw it, and you're good. And remember elementary, don't throw it at people's face. a few questions about the FBLA club here at HGA. Um, FBLA uh, stands for Future Business Leaders of America. Our advisor is Mr. Salgado. He's the 8th grade math teacher and I think he teaches AVID too. Uh, we usually meet on Mondays and Wednesdays. Um, if we have an event going on, we probably would meet more often than that. I recommend this club for people who mainly want to do something um, like in business in their lives or maybe even own their own business. Um, and also probably people who are able to kind of like always be there and are always present at every meeting. Like very constant people. Why did you join Mr. Yim's sweets club? I joined the sweets club because I wanted to try different kinds of sweets that they don't really sell a lot. What's your favorite part about it? My favorite part about the club, I would say, is we get to raise money so like we could get more sweets. Are students still able to join the club? Yes, students are still able to join the club as long as they help raise money for the club. Today we're going to be interviewing one of HGA's middle school teachers, Mr. Yim. What made you want to become a teacher? Um, when I was younger, I, I didn't get a lot of support from, um, you know, a lot of family members and the people that actually supported me the most were um, some of my teachers. So, sort of so how they gave back to me, I wanted to give back to the new set of students. What do you like to do in your free time? Uh, really just, um, take care of my son, uh, love sports, so watch sports, play sports, hang out with some friends. If there's one thing you could tell all your students for the future, what would you tell them? Uh, work hard. Um, it doesn't seem like it will pay off right now, but the harder you work, um, it just makes life a lot easier down the road. Representing my team. Party the rest of my team. Second period, gold all the way.
Gigi. 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 What do you call a sad cup of coffee? I don't know. What do you call it, Lily? A depresso. <laughs> That's so funny. Why would the no sad? Why? Because you were tired of getting picked on. <laughs> they want to do something business related in their life. And. <laughs> Can I have one? <laughs> uh, we meet. Uh, usually on Monday, Mondays and Wednesday. I said Wednesday. <laughs> yeah, we can cut it out. No, Lily Rose. Are you starting? What? Lily, I swear. <laughs> Dang, <laughs> it's you. Why would the nose? Did you did you press the play button? Hi! Oh,